In Islam the search for knowledge for intelligence is not just encouraged, it's a sacred duty. This isn't just a saying, it's a principle deeply rooted in the teachings of the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him. He once stated, seeking knowledge is an obligation upon every Muslim. This profound statement illustrates the divine importance placed on the pursuit of knowledge. In Islam, knowledge is not limited to religious studies alone, but encompasses all sectors of life. This includes sciences, arts, culture, and even our day-to-day -day interactions. It's about understanding the world around us, making sense of our experiences, and striving to gain wisdom from every opportunity. So, let's embark on this lifelong journey of learning not just from books or classrooms, but from mentors, from our own experiences, and from life itself. Because the pursuit of knowledge is more than just an intellectual exercise, it's a sacred duty. Reflection, pondering Allah's creation, His signs in the world, the verses of the Quran, unlocking deeper wisdom. When we take a moment to step back to observe and to truly see, we begin to understand the intricacies of the universe, the beauty of Allah's creation. This is not just a simple act of observation, but a profound practice of mindfulness, a spiritual exercise that nurtures our intelligence. In the quiet moments of reflection, we find clarity, we find answers to questions we didn't know we had, we find connections, patterns and signs that lead us to a deeper understanding of our purpose, our place in this world, and our relationship with Allah. By reflecting on the verses of the Quran, the world around us and our own experiences we open the doors to knowledge and wisdom. We engage our minds, our hearts and our souls in a quest for understanding, unlocking deeper wisdom through reflection. Prayer Dua, turning to Allah directly. This divine conversation is not just a ritual but a powerful tool in our journey to gain knowledge and understanding. It's a direct line of communication with our Creator, a moment of intimate connection, of reflection, of surrender, and of hope. In Islam, Dua is the very essence of worship. It's a humble admission that we are in need of Allah's guidance, mercy, and knowledge. It's an opportunity to seek His blessings for sharp intellect, clear understanding, and an open heart. As we stand in prayer, or kneel in supplication, we ask Allah to illuminate our minds, to guide us to the truth, and to grant us the wisdom to understand it. We pray for strength to apply this knowledge in our everyday lives, for the benefit of ourselves and those around us. Seeking His guidance, asking for the blessings of sharp intellect and understanding, this is the power of prayer and dua. Our health is a gift. In the teachings of the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, we find profound wisdom guiding us to care for our bodies. He taught us to eat wholesome foods, to engage in regular physical activity, and to ensure we get an adequate amount of rest. These practices are not just for the benefit of our physical well-being, but also for our mental and spiritual health. A well-nourished, well-rested body paves the way for a clear, focused mind. It allows us to better perform our duties to seek knowledge, to reflect, and to understand the world around us. It helps us to be more present in our prayers, more attentive in our studies, and more effective in our work. In the pursuit of intelligence let us not forget the vital role our health plays. After all a sound body supports a focused mind. In the words of the Holy Quran we find profound truths. This sacred scripture, the final message from God to humanity, is a guide for every aspect of life. It is a source of wisdom, a roadmap to righteousness, and a beacon of light for those seeking enlightenment. The Quran emphasizes the pursuit of knowledge, urging us to reflect, question and understand the world around us. It points to the harmonious interplay of the natural world, urging us to ponder over the signs of God in the universe. It teaches us to use our intellect, to reason, and to think critically. It is a book that nurtures our intelligence, broadens our perspective, and deepens our understanding of the divine and the worldly. It is not a book to be simply read but to be lived, to be experienced, to be understood. Listen, understand, and internalize its message. Fasting during Ramadan. The discipline of the body strengthens the spirit and sharpens the intellect. The ritual of fasting is not merely an act of abstinence from food, drink, and other physical needs. It's a time for inner reflection, devotion, and self-control. But how does this foster intelligence, you may ask? Well, when we fast, we are essentially training our minds to focus on what truly matters. This practice enhances our willpower and discipline, both of which are crucial for intellectual growth. Indeed, fasting is like a mental workout. It helps us to resist impulses, to make better decisions, and to think more clearly. It also develops our emotional intelligence, 
as we become more empathetic towards those who experience hunger on a daily basis. The holy month of Ramadan is a time to purify our thoughts, to reflect on our actions, and to strive for intellectual and spiritual growth. The discipline of the body strengthens the spirit and sharpens the intellect. Seek the company of the wise and knowledgeable. In the journey of gaining knowledge it's crucial to surround ourselves with those who inspire us, those who challenge us, and those who help us grow. In Islam, this is deeply valued. The Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, once said, A person is likely to follow the faith of his friend, so look whom you befriend. When we engage in thoughtful discussions with those who share our passion for learning, it opens up new avenues of understanding. It's not just about absorbing information, but also about refining our perspectives, questioning our assumptions and expanding our horizons. The beauty of knowledge is that it's not a solitary pursuit, it flourishes in the exchange of ideas, in the shared pursuit of understanding, it blossoms in the company of those who value wisdom and strive for it. So, let's seek out such company, let's exchange ideas, learn from each other, and grow together. Patience. Knowledge doesn't come instantly, it's a journey, a pilgrimage of sorts, taking us through the vast landscapes of learning and understanding, and as with any journey, there will be challenges, there will be moments of doubt, moments of confusion, moments where the path ahead seems steep and treacherous. But it's during these times that patience becomes our greatest ally. In Islam, patience or saber is highly valued. It's the quiet strength that helps us persevere, to keep going, to keep learning, even when it's hard, because we know that every step we take, every piece of knowledge we gain, brings us closer to Allah. It's not just about the destination, but about the journey itself, the journey of seeking knowledge. And with every challenge we overcome our understanding deepens our faith strengthens with unwavering trust in allah remain dedicated overcome obstacles from lifelong learning to prayer from self-care to the company we keep islam presents us with a pathway to nurture our intelligence as we embark on this journey let's remember the key points we've touched upon today firstly we acknowledge the sacred duty of seeking knowledge a journey that never ends a journey that takes us through books people and life experiences it's a journey that we are all obliged to undertake, as knowledge is the light that illuminates our path in life. Then, we delved into the importance of reflection on the world around us. The beauty of Allah's creation and the verses of the Quran are constant reminders of the vast universe of knowledge that lies before us. It's through this reflection that we unlock deeper wisdom and understanding. We also touched on the power of prayer and dua, Turning to Allah in supplication, asking for guidance and seeking the blessings of a sharp intellect and understanding are essential in our journey to knowledge. Health too, plays a significant role. A sound body supports a focused mind. Following the teachings of the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, we are guided to eat well, exercise and rest properly. We discussed the significance of the Holy Quran in our quest for knowledge. The profound truths hidden in its verses invite us to listen, understand, and internalize its message. The discipline of fasting during Ramadan, an act that strengthens our spirit and sharpens our intellect, was highlighted as another pathway to nurture our intelligence. We also emphasized the importance of keeping the company of the wise and knowledgeable. Engaging in meaningful discussions, exchanging ideas, and growing together contribute to our intellectual growth. Lastly, we talked about the virtues of patience and persistence. Knowledge doesn't come instantly, it requires dedication, trust in Allah, and the courage to overcome obstacles. Through gratitude and unwavering faith, may Allah grant us the clarity of mind to understand His world and serve others. Thank you, dear viewers, for your attention and commitment to this enlightening journey. I hope that you found value in today's episode and that it will inspire you to continue your quest for knowledge. Remember, our journey doesn't end here. There is always more to learn, more to understand, and more to reflect upon. As we continue to explore the depths of knowledge, let's not forget the importance of sharing. So, if you found this video beneficial, please do not hesitate to share it with your friends and family. And if you haven't already, remember to subscribe to our channel and give this video a like. Your engagement truly helps us reach more people and spread the light of knowledge, May we always remember to send blessings upon our beloved Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, and let's not let anything delay our obedience to Allah. As we embark on our day, may we carry these lessons with us, applying them in our lives and striving to be better Muslims. Peace be upon you all. Until our next episode stay blessed and keep seeking knowledge.